fastest across the uh, top, with the second sector across the top of the mountain, and it comes to the end. What does he do? Second. Second, oh, it's Augusto Farfus. So a 2 1. Vanderlinda goes to the top. It's a 1 7. So we thought they'll be into the set. One's just. They're going to go deep into the ones in this session as it continues to go on. And this afternoon, when we go for the top 10 shootout, we're looking at each other knowing what we're about to say. I'm not going to say it. I'm leaving no, it out there. Do it I'm leaving it out there. I am leaving it out there. Don't you look at I, me like that, I, Mr. Tander. <laughs> I've not worked with you before. I'm just, I'm... <laughs> we're all thinking it. Lap record territory. 201.26 is the outright fastest ever official lap by a GT3 car in this trim, we might add, uh, yeah. in Bathurst 12 hour history. Shane Van Gisberg in 2016. That lap from Sheldon Vanderlinder and indeed before him, Maro Engel. It's the first lap in the one at this location since as oh. Maro Engel goes quicker with a 1-0. Oh, Forget about SVG. That is the quickest lap by a GT3 car <laughs> in 12-hour history and there's more to come because Chaz Mostert's going quicker. Well, we wondered, we speculated it is a new tyre. We thought it might be just a little bit too warm. But it's turned out that these guys, exactly what Garth Tender was talking about earlier on, they know the limits of these cars and they've pushed it, Garth, right to the edge of the envelope there.